Hello guys, Matthew McAvoy here again, and tonight I'm just answering someone's question about how to make a hourly log sheet, um, how to format it and make it look good. So we're just going to open up Excel, 2010, 2013, same difference, start on a blank. Um, we'll start right up at the top, we're going to start with time, log, Now, and then we'll skip a line. I'm gonna say if we're doing a full day, 12 a.m., 1 a.m., and then Excel is smart, it knows what we want to do. So, I'm gonna select these two and hover over the bottom to when my cursor chains, changes, and then I'll right click and drag it down, and you can see the time off to the side. We want to go to 11 p.m. That's a full day at the bottom. We'll leave some room for um, notes from other personnel. And, and now we're going to do a little bit of formatting. Um, I select all these, make it bold. Make it align center and make it as wide as it needs to be. Um, this middle one, we want to leave people room to write. So I'm going to um, right click it, go to column width, and I'm going to put in 60. then we are going to um, make sure that we have, when we print, I want the lines to show up so that people have straight lines. And I went under the page layout ribbon and you can see here it says grid lines. I want to view them. I also want to print them. It'd be really nice. And then you can see right over here, um, this is actually my page marker. Um, that's how far I can go to have a full page. So I'm going to go right there. And I'm taking up an entire page. And I'm going to select everything that I want. And come down to the bottom. There it is right there. I'm going to go back to the home ribbon and put a border around everything. Nice thick border. And let's see how that's going to look when it prints. So go to File, Print. That shows us a print preview. Um, it's pretty long and lots of notes. So we can change the orientation to Landscape. And then I also want to do, if you click on margins, do custom margins, I want to center horizontal and settle center vertically. That way it's just going to center everything in the middle. Um, I have a lot of white space so I can um, spread everything out a little bit. I'm going to go back and I'm going to make this a little bit wider. And because you can see I changed how far down the page is by changing the orientation, I'm going to undo my border and reselect my print area which is right there and put the thick border back up that way I'm just on one page and then I'll go to file 
footprint and there you have it a nice hourly log um, for personnel you can play around with it and um, pretty much do anything you want with it Excel is really smart and will help you out I hope that answers your question and thanks for posting